Hello, my name is Yu Chen. I'm the product manager at APIO. We are a local software platform. On APIO, we build apps to simplify small business workflows. Today, I want to show you our e-commerce app, Shopping. For people who are currently selling on Google Forms, asking customers to DM them on Instagram or TikTok, we've built a simpler option for you. Shopping doesn't have the drag and drop design configurations you've seen on Wix or Squarespace. We also don't need any payment solution like Square to start. We want to enable people to focus on their product and simplify the rest. Let us help you communicate with customers, manage orders, or control inventories. Now, let me give you a quick overview of shopping. You are looking at our demo store. Feel free to play with it and place trial orders after watching this video. This is how your website greets your customers. Your store name and the logo and store background representing your brand. Shoppers can click the right arrow or swipe right on their phones to view more information. Keep scrolling down, shopper will first see the category tiles so they immediately get the idea of what you are selling, or you can choose to hide this section to show products directly. Tap the hamburger menu on the top left. Shoppers can also quickly jump to a certain category or view all products. Your contact information will show up here as well. At the top, you will find a search bar to help your customers easily find what they want and a notification bell to display your latest promotion or announcement. Shopping store is responsive to any screen size, so your customers can place orders on their phones. Enough of layout and design. Now let me show you the customer journey. Click a product to enlarge and view details. We support multiple images and markdown styling. You can also set up multi-option products like this chiffon cake. Customers can select the size and flavors. When an item is out of stock or reaches the inventory cap, it will show out of stock message or any wording you'd like. Now we go to the shopping cart. It remembers shopping history using cookie. So even if the customer closes the browser window, they can pick up where they left off easily and continue the shopping. Shopping's checkout process is very straightforward. Customers first review their orders, then put in their contact information. You can customize what information you like to collect. Then they select shipping. Finally, the payment. We currently support Stripe to take credit cards and a few other offline payments like PayPal, Zelle, Venmo or pay at pickup. Let us know if you don't find your preferred payment method. After submitting the order, your customer will receive an automated confirmation email from you. Do you need an online store to kick off your business? Keep watching. Let's set up a shopping store real quick. Go to telescope.apiobuild.com. This is our app platform where you can find all of our app flow and apps. So first sign in by clicking this door symbol. Sign in with your Google account. If you have multiple Google accounts, be sure to use the same one throughout the process. If you have pop-up window blocker, whitelist apiobuild.com so you can log in. Click shopping stores flow tile to begin. Let's name the store. Keep it short and sweet. Let's say put APIO dessert shop. We will create two Google Sheets, one for the product catalog and the other one for the order. Just follow the steps here. Click the plus sign to open a new Google Sheet. Click the copy sign to copy the example data. Paste the example data to the Google Sheet. Then share the Google Sheet with us. Click the email address field to copy the address. Go back to your Google Sheet. Click Share at the top right corner. Add the copied email as an editor and uncheck Notify People option. 
Finally, copy the Google Sheet URL and paste it back to Heloscope and click the unlock sign to authorize. Repeat the same process to create a second Google Sheet to collect orders. Again, click the plus sign to open a new Google Sheet and copy the example data. This time we only have the header row. Paste it to the Google Sheet. Copy this email address and share the Google Sheet with us. Finally, copy the Google Sheet URL and paste it back to the Taylor Scope and click Unlock Sign to authorize. Now you have two Google Sheets ready. Next step is optional. If you want to send order confirmation emails, click the plus sign to grant us permission to send emails on your behalf. You can add this later if you change your mind. Ta-da! The store is created. Take us less than five minutes. Let's take a look. Click go to store. Pretty sure my dessert shop is not selling cats and I want my store look like a legit dessert store like this one. We go back to Taylor Scope. This time we click shopping app. And this is where you manage all the configuration about your shopping store. Now we go to the store we just created. First, I want to give my store logo. I already uploaded my logo to an image hosting website called imgbb.com. So this is how I get my image URL. I paste my logo URL here. Store description is where you say something about your stores, operating hours, or any details about pickup or shipping. We support Markdown to style your text. In the layout section, I can change the store background. Let's make it purple. You can also set up order input, social media handles, how the customers can contact you, how you like to receive payment, shipping, discount, and tax. We'll cover this in our next video. Meanwhile, the Get Help button will take you to our documentation site, and you'll find answers there. You can update the settings anytime. Just remember to hit the Save button. Now our dessert shop looks much better. Let's add some products. We go to Catalog Google Sheet. As long as you have name and price filled out, the product will show on the website. So we type in Strawberry Tart here and make it $15. Again, I also add the image URL from the image hosting site. Now we refresh the store, the strawberry tart is here. I can also add multiple images and write the product descriptions. Also categorize my products. We will take more closer look on how this fields work in future videos. You can also find tutorial on our documentation site. Let's try adding more products. I've already uploaded all of my images to IMGBB, the image hosting website. Now I copy all the links back to my Google Sheet. See, this is how fast you can add products through Google Sheet. I added 18 more products within 5 minutes. Now it's selling time. I'm ordering some lemonade, strawberry tart, and my purchase will show up in my cart here. There's a 5% discount for orders over $50, so I'm going to order more sweets. Order confirmed. Then they will get an order confirmation email sent directly from your Gmail. Not a no reply mailbox, so it's easy for your customers to contact you regarding their orders. Now we go back to the order Google Sheet we created earlier. The order we just placed show up on here, including the customers' names, the items they purchased, and everything else. You can set up notification rule so you will get an email every time someone makes a purchase. 
Try shopping now and start selling your products online. We are working on more features. Let us know your thoughts. If you run into any issues, visit our documentation site link below, or feel free to contact us on Facebook. Thank you for watching.